In today's video, I'm going to show you how to change your elevation units on your Garmin Forerunner 955 watch. So what exactly are we talking about here? When you use the altimeter or if you use the elevation data fields from this watch, you have a couple different options. You can basically display them. If you look at mine, they're being displayed in feet, but maybe you're in an area where meters is more the standard unit. How would we change that? Now, first, let me say on the Forerunner 955, you've got a couple different options. I'm going to be doing it with the buttons in today's video. You could use touchscreen to do some of the same stuff that I'm doing. The other thing is you could make this change in the Garmin Connect app on your cell phone and then simply sync the watch and the changes will take place on the watch. One of the things that gets a little bit confusing though on this watch is the change that you're making will make the change everywhere within de delivered Garmin functionality. So this is a delivered Garmin watch face. When we make this change, we should see our elevation change here. However, this watch also connects to the Garmin Connect IQ store, and you can download watch faces from other developers that have no affiliation with Garmin. Those developers might not always recognize the change that you make on your elevation or other units. We'll take a look at that here in a second. So if we look, this is a Garmin delivered watch face. My elevation is showing 315 feet. Let's go change to a different watch face. So I'm gonna press and hold the middle button. I'm gonna choose watch faces. I'm gonna go down and this looks like a good one. Now this one came off of Garmin Connect IQ. You'll notice down here in the middle is my elevation. Again, it's showing in feet. My range of feet is 287 to 288 for the last four hours. So that's cool. Let's go ahead and let's change these units. So how would we go change our elevation units? We're going to press and hold the middle button on the left-hand side. That'll take us into our menu. Once we're in the menu, we're simply going to press. We can use the up or down button, but the easiest way is to simply press the up button once because you're going to need to go to system. It'll take you directly to system because it's the last item in your menu. We're going to press the upper right button to select system. Then under system, we can either use the up or down button. We're going to go down to format. Once we're on format, we're going to press the upper right button to select. And then the very first option we should see under there is units. We're going to press the upper right button to select units. And we've got a few different options we can change in here. We've got our distance, pace, elevation is what we're looking for. Mine is currently set to feet. If I wanted to change that, I could simply choose elevation and I could switch it down to meters. Now I've changed my elevation units to meters, so when I go look at my altimeter values, we should be seeing it in meters instead. I could press the back button several times to go back, or I could press and hold the middle button on the left-hand side, and that will take me back to my watch face. Now we just made the change, but if we look at my watch face, nothing changed, it's still showing in feet. The reason for that is this developer did not make um, they made their development to only show in feet. Now let's go look at the Garmin delivered watch face. I'm gonna press and hold menu, choose watch face, and let's go back. And sure enough, on the delivered Garmin watch face, it's now showing 96 uh, meters, whereas I think before it was showing 315. If we go look at my altimeter view, you can see the same thing. 96 meters is being shown all of my altimeter values are now showing meters instead of feet. So everything gets changed within the delivered Garmin functionality, but that doesn't always mean that your third-party apps or third-party watch faces will change. Anyway, that's how we change the elevation units on our Garmin Forerunner 955. Again, you can make the same change using your Garmin Connect app on your cell phone. As always, I hope the video helps.